hey guys welcome back to next gen blogger and in this video i want to show you how you can create a wave on text in vsdc free video editor so it's actually super easy to create a wave on text in vsdc so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now the first thing which we will do is we will write some text on top of our screen and so to do that go to add object go to text click on text and then click on OK. Now mark your text object on top of the screen like this and then click on this particular button which says set the same size as the parent has. Perfect. Now let's write some text inside our text box. So let me just write let's say create wave and let me just center align my text by clicking right here. Let me change the font from Arial to Montserrat Black and let me also increase the font size to somewhere around 200 pixels. Perfect. Now the next thing which you need to do is you need to double click on the text object and then go to video effects, go to transforms, select distort and then click on OK. Now currently the duration of my distort effect is the entire duration of my text which is 10 seconds. So decrease the duration of the distort effect from 10 seconds to somewhere around let's say 2 seconds. Perfect. Now look inside the distort effect settings which is present inside the properties window and as you can see inside the type option currently faceted glass is selected. So click on this drop down list and select this option called Z-Wave. Now Z-Wave contains two important options frequency and phase and so what you need to do is first of all change this from constant parameter value to linear parameter change inside the phase option so that we get two values 10 semicolon 10 and now change the values from 10 semicolon 10 to 360 semicolon 0 and then press enter perfect now repeat the process change this from constant parameter value to linear parameter change inside the frequency option and as you can see once again we have the values 10 semicolon 10 and now what you need to do is write the values 1000 semicolon 0 and then press enter perfect so currently the values inside the frequency option are 1000 semicolon 0 and as you can see this is how our text is looking currently on screen so let me just quickly play the video for you perfect so what we will do is we will decrease the frequency so basically we will decrease the values inside the frequency option so currently the values are 1000 semicolon 0 so change the values from 1000 semicolon 0 to 500 semicolon 0 and now once again let's just play the video from the start and see how our text is looking perfect let's further decrease the values from 500 semicolon 0 to let's say 250 semicolon 0 and let me just quickly play the video for you once again from the start so now the wave is kind of you know clearly visible on screen 1000 is a big value so that's why that wave effect is not immediately visible on screen but when you kind of put the values 250 semicolon 0 inside the frequency option the wave is now kind of clearly visible which is present on top of your text so let me just quickly play the video for you perfect and finally you can also try 100 semicolon 0 so let me just change the values from 250 semicolon 0 to 100 semicolon 0 and let me just quickly play the video for you once again from the start and right here as you can see the wave is clearly visible on top of the text so let me just quickly play the video for you 
perfect so you can play around the values inside this frequency option and uh, you know write any values as per your choice but uh, this is how you can create a wave on top of your text in vstc free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see in the next video till then thanks for watching